I think this is gonna be our first AR experience on the channel and it's nice that it's gonna be with Cubism since the developer of it is known for pushing like experimental technology with hand tracking pass through now. It's just nice to see people trying out things. We'll do combination hand tracking and pass through. I'm really curious how that's actually gonna work like you've seen my room by now at this point so there's nothing to hide. <laughs> also recording pass through is kind of tricky but I managed to do it with side quests and stuff because normally it would be just a black screen and that's all you would be getting today. Okay, so enable and I see stuff. Of course Quest doesn't really have HD cameras and stuff like that so everything is gonna be black and white for now. It's like I see my hands and kind of virtual ones. It's so blending together. We can overlay. Okay, that works well. It's not fully the size of my hand but I guess it's better than nothing. It's so interesting now combining those two technologies. This is the future. Of course it's not gonna be perfect, but what was perfect in the beginning? Though it works well for my taste, like come on. Hey, <laughs> come back here. Yeah, that's my recording setup, that's my PC. Now you can see behind the scenes. Yes, I'm playing on my bed, if anyone didn't catch up. I guess, you know, this technology will become better over time, just like anything. But like for AR, especially on Quest, it's fairly impressive because this headset wasn't made in mind of full-scale AR experiences, but like if you give the tools to the developers, of course they're gonna utilize it. Let me switch to the controllers for now. Did I screw up the puzzle already? Jesus. Okay, right, here we go. <laughs> yeah, like now you have an illusion that something virtual is in the real world. I wish we would have better cameras because then the illusion would be pretty much seamless. But that's the difference between VR and AR. It's just a simple puzzle, but like thinking about other experiences, I saw I think on Reddit like Death Horizon did something, now Cubism, so people just try out stuff and that's more important. Funnily enough, I'm literally solving the same puzzle in every video at this point and I still managed to screw it up. Yeah, this is not for me today. <laughs> but yeah, just real fast something to try out. I mean, we'll have to see what's next level with Pass Through. It's not a standard recording, but I was basically just curious how early adaptation of AR would look like with Quest.